Hello guys and welcome to today's video. Well today we are gonna do a little poll against my friend in his Hyundai E30N. So uh, I'm probably gonna get him on the lounge and then he will come back because he has like 50 horsepower more than I do but his car is front wheel drive and he's not the best shifting driver in the world so I'm probably getting him on the lounge and then he will wheel back in. Uh, I mean, that's how I think it will go. But first of all, we have him here behind me again, like always, uh, if you can see him at least. Um, but first we are going to do something which was long overdue, and that's a McDonald's drive-in, because they were closed for about three to four weeks, and uh, it was just too long going without McDonald's, and we are finally doing a drive through uh, the first few days were just a little bit too hectic too many people so it was like we're gonna wait three four days and now we're gonna see if it's a little bit obtainable to wait for a hamburger anyway see you when I'm there so we arrived at McDonald's finally um, yeah it's pretty busy but it's still doable so we decided to wait for the row uh, because like I said it is a pretty you know busy moment because McDonald's is one of the only driving drive-ins that's open so a lot of people are like McDonald's so it's a little bit more busy because you know the restaurant is not open because of the whole corona thing so yeah uh, at least it's a good thing because now we can drive and, and uh, make it an essential replacement because we're getting food so we're not gonna get a ticket for that so that's a good thing uh, but yeah Oh, I get a call. Almost getting our food and then we are gonna do a little drag race after we finish the food, of course. He's being a little prick doing rev bombs in the tunnel. <laughs> we are little kids. Only our toys got bigger over the years. <laughs> You're ready for a race to get destroyed by a 114i. <laughs> Doing a little photo shoot and we all have our drones with us so we're gonna take some nice shots. Just had McDonald's and then we are going to do a little pull next to each other from standstill because on the rolling he's anyway faster because of 50 more horsepower. So yeah, I'm pretty curious. like a red tomato on my screen <laughs> uh, first of all he's going to install some spacers on his rear to have a little bit more of an aggressive look and then we are gonna do a little pull uh, next to each other we first had some fun with my new drone uh, there is a trustworthy beamer in our place as always maybe I should you know use some scissors too I don't know I think it's it's on the edge of I think it's just enough I'm not sure if I would do it only like 0.5 millimeters or so, centimeters or something I don't know but yeah it looks very nice yeah first we're gonna do the spacers installation and then we're gonna do a little pull and now we will see uh, who is faster okay so the new spacer is installed on one wheel and yeah it looks way more aggressive if you look at this it it suits his body kit way better also so yeah I mean that looks really I mean I would say on the edge and this you know this is still stock so th that wheel is still in way too much so yeah that spacer yeah definitely gives a way more aggressive look when they're both installed we're gonna have a look at the rear wheel but yeah this looks so much better 
Okay, so they're installed on both sides right now and yeah, it gives Can you shut up with that 1.03 cylinder bullshit? <laughs> Hooligan! And, anyway uh, So yeah, I mean it looks way better Way more aggressive without going too far. It suits the body kit very well actually uh, So it gives a more fat aggressive look to the rear. So yeah, it's a nice little modification for only 19 euro So yeah, I mean Can't complain for that money Looks nice and the dog is escaping there. Oh Yeah, the doggy <laughs> So yeah, now we're gonna race and I'm gonna destroy your ass Oké, okay. klaar? Komt hij er nog achter me? 3, 2, 1, 0. I have him on the lounge. But he's coming back slightly. And yeah, now he's really coming back. 50 more horsepower. Yeah. Oké, okay. klaar? Komt hij er nog achter me? 3, 2, 1, 0. I have him on the lounge. But he's coming back slightly. En yeah, now he's really coming back. 50 more horsepower. Yeah. So yeah, we're back home right now, uh, he's going also back home. It's, it went like I said, I beat him on the lounge because his best time ever was 6.3 seconds, my best time ever is 5.7, so that's more than half a second difference. Only when he launches perfect, or when I launch perfect, so there's always a 0 0.5 dif lounge difference of going from 0 to 100 between our cars. But then you know when traction is not an issue anymore, he just flies away because he has 50 more horsepower and then you know he weighs about his car weighs about 150 kilograms more than mine but his fuel tank was almost empty he had like had like a quarter in it mine was just full and i'm also 15 kilograms heavier than he is so that 150 kilogram at the end is maybe a hundred kilo yeah 100 kilogram difference and 100 kilograms don't justify 50 horsepower and also you have to think that he has less drivetrain loss being a front-wheel driven car because mine is rear-wheel driven so we, the big drivetrain to the rear also has a little bit more loss so yeah at the end of the day it's thinkable that his car is faster than mine I have to go like a turbo upgrade but then I have to do internals and stuff like that so maybe I'm going stage 2 on a later date with a downpipe, an intake, boost pipe, charge pipe, whatever, hitting about 250 and then it will be way, way closer. It will still be faster on top, but the difference will be smaller. Um, we will see, we will see. Um, so anyway, guys, thanks for watching this video, and I'll see you guys very, very soon. Bye!